congratulations on this role. Um, I wanted to ask you a tricky question right off the bat. Um, I had cancer and one of the things that was most difficult was the expression in people's eyes when they looked at me, especially if they loved me. You captured that in this role. How was it for you to deal with those emotions and talk about the toll maybe it took on you? Well, thank you for sharing that. Um, um, I don't, um, you know, I, I have to say that I think that in that regard, Dakota had a much more difficult job to do. Um, you know, I remember when I, I was uh, losing somebody who was much older, but they, um, I was with them and they saw them saying goodbye to people one after the other in the last couple of days. And it was always the other person who came to see them that broke down. It was hardest for them to say goodbye. And it was, uh, I saw this person who was so frail uh, and so much pain and so, you know, just barely there uh, was the one who had to do all the consoling, do all the comforting, and to, and to make sure that, it, that the other person who was being, you know, who was staying, who, was, who had come to say goodbye to them, um, felt, uh, felt okay. And I just thought it's just uh, how much strength that took, how much like courage to sort of not feel bad for yourself, to rise above all of that and to care for other people when you are going through something so difficult. And I, I saw Dakota do that uh, really well. Well, I thought you did a brilliant job of it as well. It uh, really made us feel. Um, on a lighter note, um, your wife in the film has a bucket list. Yeah. So uh, do you have a bucket list? And you also tell a couple of fibs to get her to her bucket list. So how good are you at exaggerating the truth? And what is your bucket list? Hmm. I'm a terrible, terrible, terrible liar. I can't <laughs> exaggerate the truth. In, in life, in real life, not in movies or whatever, I just am too burdened by any secrets. I can't keep secrets. I can't do it. Uh, and I've learned like, that's okay. I guess I'm just not meant to. Um, so as for, you know, bucket list items, um, I think that if that's what you meant, a lot of mine have to do with, um, traveling and also recently I've been thinking about finding people that I used to be very close with when I was a kid and mm -hmm. seeing what they're like now and how you know what the last you know 30 years has, has been like for them I think that would be interesting oh my god what a lovely thing to do mm -hmm. um, thank you so much I was so moved by this I appreciate your time oh thank you for saying that